talk about simplifying using a scientific notation in an expression that looks like this. So you would be simply asked to simplify using scientific notation, as I just said. And so we have to change each of these decimal numbers into scientific notation. So this has a decimal, 3,400 has a decimal on the right here. So I would move it one, two, three places to the left. That makes this number smaller, 3.4. Remember, this number needs to be between 1 and 10. And since I made that one smaller, I have to multiply by a bigger number. That is a positive exponent on 10. Uh, and that exponent is determined by the number of place values you moved a decimal point. So that's the first one. We're going to take that number. I put it in parentheses now and multiply it by the scientific notation version of this, which would be moving it two point places to the right, makes that a larger number, 0 0.006 is much smaller than 6, 6 times 10, and since I moved the decimal point to the right, I need a small number here, that's a negative exponent, or a fraction of 10, a fractional power of 10, 10 over 1 over 10 to the third power, 1 1 1,000th. Um, and I do the same with the bottom. So that's going to be 4 times 10 to the negative 3 as well. Moving that three places, uh, that decimal point three places to the right. I moved it the wrong direction. And then this one moves two places. We get a 1.7 times 10 to the negative 2. So the advantage of this is that we can now multiply these smaller numbers together and deal with the exponents separately makes it a little simpler in the long run. So 3.4 times 6 and these are all multiplied by the way this is 3.4 times 10 to the third which is multiplied by 6 times 10 to the negative 3. Since there are all multiplications up there we can rearrange them. So we can multiply 3.4 times 6 and 3.4 times 6 is 20.4. You can check that on your calculator. And then 10 to the third times 10 to the negative third. Multiply those two powers. They have the same base, so we add the exponents. That would be 10 to the zero power. And on the bottom, we have 4 times 1.7, which is 6.8, times 10 to the negative 3 plus negative 2. That makes negative 5. Okay, so we've simplified the top and the bottom by multiplying those two together in with their respective parts. And then we did the same with the bottom. Now, the top number here is not in scientific notation. Do you remember why? It's because 20.4 is bigger than 10. But we're not going to worry about that because we're going to divide first. So take your calculator and divide 20.4 by 6.8. You should find that that is 3 and 10 to the 0 power divided by 10 to the negative 5 would mean we subtract those exponents. So that's 10 to the 0 minus negative 5, or this is 3 times 10 to the positive 5. 0 minus negative 5 is 0 plus 5, which is positive 5. So your answer is 3 times 10 to the 5th, which is in scientific notation.